Okay, so we have, we've been working on the Susi grip, right? What the thing, of, uh, what I think I want you to work on the most is understanding the philosophy that comes with these techniques, right? So again, rule number one rule for defense is what? Don't be there, right? So when he, she strikes, when she's striking me here, I'm not going to stand here and get hit. Does that make sense? Right? I'm going to get out of the way, so I'm going to step in here. Correct? Even with the sushi grip, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to step here. Because I, if the target is here, I'm going to step away from it. Now, if you were to even take it to the next level, right, when she strikes here, my arm is against her chest. This is more of an advanced technique, but why? Why do I do this? Because she can't hit me with the other arm and me not feel it, right? So now, when she strikes here, there's, there's, my, there's my block. Okay, so let's go to the other side so the camera can see. So when she strikes here, my elbow, my arm, my forearm is across her chest. Thank you. Let's get... Um, Mr. Steve here. Nice. Pen is madder than a sword. That's right. That's where we're working on the stealth pen. So he strikes me here. Here. I'm across his chest. Right? Cause he, so he's a big person. He tries to smack me. He can definitely smack me because his arms are, are long enough to attack me, right? But the, the point here is that when he's trying to attack me, I'm going to make it harder for him. Sir. Okay? So when he strikes... Boom, I'm here. I'm running my elbow into his chest. And if, he, if, if I feel that move in, then I'm going to come out this way and strike here. Why? What's the principle? What's the number one rule for defense? Don't be there. Right. So if he strikes here, boom. I'm sorry, one more time. Boom, I'm here. He tries to hit me with his other hand. I'm going to go through. And now I'm, I'm back into this position. Right? So he comes in. Boom. And he tries to hit me in the other arm. Boom, I'm here also. I can also do this. Then who about here? And now I'm in this movement. Right? Sir. Come over here, sir. So when he strikes again, boom, he strikes me with his other arm. Boom, I'm here. Notice that again, my left arm is covering across his chest. Sir. Here. Then I who about here? And I'm out. Sir. Correct? Yes, sir. That's, that's how we, that's the rule for defense, which is what? Don't be there. Don't be there. I'm not going to be in his attack range, but he's going to be in mine. Sir. So he attacks again. Boom, I'm here. He tries to hit me again. Boom, I'm here. I hope I, boom, boom. And I'm, notice how I'm circling out. Sir. Right? Sir. So that's because I'm still using that principle. Not to be in the area where he thinks I'm going to be at for him to attack me. He attacks me again. Boom. He attacks me on the other side. Boom. I'm here. He attacks me. Boom. Again. Boom. I'm here. Boom. Boom. And out. Sir. Does that make sense? Sir. Thank you. That's how we, that's how when we're creating these techniques, it's not the techniques that creates a philosophy. It's a philosophy that creates a technique. And the philosophy is the number one rule for defense is what? Don't be there. All right. That's class. Let's bow out. Uh, this is Chief Francis from Filipino Martial Arts School. And if you're looking to buy your own stealth pen, go to www.atomicbear.com. Use Big Boy Screamador to get 20% off. And if you're looking for a school in the Inland Empire, Orange County, Riverside area, go to www.fmaschool.com. Until next time, this is Chief Francis. Peace out. God bless. And keep swinging them sticks.